hi aquarius welcome back guys we are looking at the solar eclipse for april the 8th the full solar eclipse for april the 8th today i mean not today why i say that so some hap could be happening for you guys aquarius at the end of um april i mean at the end of march 2024 is while i'm filming this right now i will get these out very fast um today is march 28 2024 i'm filming this for april the 8th 2024 so please give me a card for Aquar aquarius april the 8th what is coming into their life or what is going to improve in their life after april the 8th for aquarius what's going to improve in their life for Aquarius after April the 8th. There it is. There it is. All right. So it is major arcana. So you you know, it's destiny. Okay. It's destiny that you wake up after the solar eclipse. Or you're going to have even more ascension, more downloads, more awakening. Okay. I do feel you already woke or you wouldn't even be on this channel. So that's what I'm saying. You guys are going to have a strong epiphany. Let's see about what. All right, you got wishes coming true, and you also got money coming in. You guys see that? Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, you are wishing for a family. You're wishing for a soulmate, someone that you could... I'm sorry, where am I? I don't know why I'm holding it over there. So this hasn't came in yet, okay? And I do see your wishes are getting ready to come true. Ooh, they're coming true after this the big solar eclipse of april the 8th 2024 all right your wishes are getting ready to come true you have the nine of cups at the bottom of the deck strong pisces energy is going to be flowing through you aquarius okay you could have a lot of psychic powers after april the 8th you could feel intuitive you could be dreaming uh things before they happen after april the 8th your intuitive energies are going to be very heightened you're going to feel very gifted you could also have psychic gifts i could be talking to psychics here medians i could be talking to someone who's very clairvoyant very smart and intelligent they're really pointing out your intelligence okay they're talking about you are a guru or you are got a um the you know the iq you're above iq okay you're either something like that you guys are very intelligent something along those lines okay maybe you work on computers or you do some kind of work with computers or something like that they also showed me the word ai oh artificial intelligence so are you guys a computer programmer I mean, are you going back to school for this? Are you going to school or? Mm. If, if it's, you know, maybe your husband is in this uh, computers. And um, then you're also telling me software. So your husband could work in computers or something. Your future husband. I'm talking about future. Sorry, guys. You haven't met him yet. I'm just talking away. <laughs> I got to keep you guys up to date. So, yes, you haven't met him yet. <laughs> okay. Um, your wish is about to come in. Okay. Your wish is about to come true. I do see you've been making a lot of wishes um, for money, a lot of money. With this Ten of Pentacles behind the Nine of Cups, guys, you could get a large lump sum of money. Your family could inherit money. Okay. You can inherit money. You could also inherit property with the Ten of Pentacles. I'm so freaking excited. It's unbelievable. So, something's about to make you super excited after this solar eclipse okay and it's going to be concerning money and wealth and prosperity and success and a lot of abundance here also you know you could be wishing for good luck good fortune something is changing definitely for you um concerning like family dynamics and stuff after april the 8th 2024 I do feel you have someone coming in. Look at the bottom of the deck here. I mean, I am looking, though, at the Nine of Cups. Behind that is Ten of Pentacles. But you got a, you have a person here coming in. You got the Knight of Swords. Can be. Doesn't have to be. Air Energy, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. You got someone of Air. Also got someone of Virgo and Pisces coming in here. Strong Pisces. Nine of Cups. Hang man, it's Pisces Energy. Someone's coming in. I do feel they're desperate. They, they're not really telling no one. They're not letting nobody know. Because um, maybe they, they it's, it's weighing on them that they're not talking though, right? It's weighing on them that they're hiding, that they want to come back in this fast. I do see someone coming in very fast. The Knight of Swords is the strongest and fastest moving knight in the tarot deck. 
I do see your wish coming true. Like literally after April 8th, 2024, um, Aquarius, you know, it looks like you manifested a strong Pisces energy. This Pisces could be intuitive. They could also be psychic. Um, yeah, you manifested a strong Pisces or a strong Virgo energy. And I also got Aquarius for the air energy. Whoever this person is that's coming in, they're quiet, okay? They're not letting no one know they're coming towards you. They're being quiet, and they want me to look at this. What is this card in the deck? Okay, four of cups. Okay, they could be bored right now, or either you. You could be bored right now. And if someone's asking you out or wanting to date you or spend time with you, you're rejecting that right now. So after April 8th, you will be rejecting people, places, and things that no longer serve you. Might feel a little bored because you're going to be woke to something here, okay? You're woke to something. And your wishes are coming true. That's what I'm saying at the bottom.